man, it's been a while since I did something like this. Feels good getting back in the groove, you know? You always did have a habit of stripping them down. Well, yeah. Everyone's the same underneath all this bullshit. Scientist, doctor, whatever. Listen here. It's not too late for you. But if you don't release me... You'll have your assassin hunt us down? I'll take extensive legal action against you. Huh. Who knows what'd happen if you did that. I might accidentally let that video loose to the press. <laughs> what? If that doesn't sound good to you, start talking. You're gonna tell us everything you know about 89. <sighs> I'm ready when you are, man. Or you wanna rough him up some more first? Why me? What do you people want? Who are those guys at the batting center? Well, I... <laughs> you mentioned how powerful you are. Did you hire them to protect you? <sighs> Out with it already. Quit acting like you got any goddamn dignity. You've made me a very happy man today. Why don't we have some real fun now that the interview's out of the way, hmm? My little minx. Who would have thought the scientist who was gonna save the world would have turned out to be some pervy asshole? Your name's gonna go down in history if this gets out. And not how you're hoping. Stop. I'm begging you, please! Who were those thugs at the batting center? Hitmen. On the Ministry of Health payroll. Ichinose's payroll, in other words. That's right. I think you mean, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Ichinose's son knows I've been abducted. More of them could rush in here any minute if you don't release me. <laughs> if you haven't noticed, we've got this whole fighting thing pretty down by now. <sighs> Next question. It's about what happened three years ago. <laughs> huh? An Alzheimer's patient at the ADDC by the name of Wakusan was murdered. His body found buried far out in the mountains. At the time, Shinpei Okubo was thought to be the killer. But the truth is, it was an unforeseen consequence of 89, which Shono had administered to this Wakusan. You knew, didn't you? What? Cat got your tongue? Guess you're about to become internet famous then. <laughs> Wait! Answer me, Kido! Yes! I knew. Who told you? When? How? I'm sorry. I can't say any more than that. If I did, I... Please, just give me some time to figure things out. Time's one thing I don't have. Shinpei Okubo's about to get executed for a murder he didn't commit. What? I need to get every last bit of information out of you right here. I'll even resort to torture if I have to. Torture? You'd break the law over this? What? That doesn't sound fun to you? Of course not! Then start talking! <laughs> Nobody's gonna come help you now. I'll give you a chance to think it over. You better be ready by the time I come back. Kido's already a broken man. My guess? At this point, he's just desperate to save his own skin. Yeah, I guess so. Maybe you should take a breather. I'm sure giving Kido some time to stool will make him realize talking's the only option. We'll keep an eye on him in the meantime. Thanks, Sukiura. I appreciate it. Hey, even a guy like you needs to take breaks. You've been up and out all freaking day. <laughs> 